All right. Welcome. This is Fatty Hemsey. It's uh, April 12th, uh, 2022. It's about 12 9, 12, I mean, nine, nine minutes after noon. The purpose of this meeting is uh, QA for those who've been here and have some questions. Of course, we're going to, this recording will be posted. As always, we, we are very audio visual because I, I'm time bankrupt. And also, I want to make sure I've covered everything. You make me a phone call. I'm not looking at something. Don't tell you that. That could be a legal issue. So I can't give legal advice, individual legal advice. It's going to be where I give that advice is to be recorded. The, you know, it's not a, I don't have full, uh, as a newsletter writer, I don't have a full First Amendment rights like most of you guys do. So I've got to be careful. It's just the financial services are a highly regulated industry. And one of the things I got to do is uh, show, uh, show you right up front our uh, Non disclosure. I'm not, I'm sorry, disclaimer. Here's a disclaimer. And you could see it's right out the front. Before you come in, uh, we pick, we, we attach it to a bunch of our posts. So you could see what, what's involved there. Yeah. Just, and you could see the different, different kind of disclaimer depending on what, what we're trying to do. Uh, the different packs. So please, and by clicking in, that means you've read these. Okay. Remember that. You have to do this. Now, over time, it's evolved a bit, but it's very fair. It's just you realize uh, we can't control the markets or the internet or number of factors. This we're in an electronic environment. So things could go bad. You need to be aware of it. This morning, one of my trade, one of my accounts would not take my trade. I just sat there. Like, huh? I'm looking at my balance in the account. I look at the number of contracts I have. I said, this is impossible. And then it caught up. It wasn't me. It was the machine. That caught up. said, the, the backlog worked out. It got to took my order and this showed received. The problem is it was not the price I wanted. It moved quite a bit. Who are you going to bitch to? It doesn't work. When I opened a account with time at trade, trade station or before it was in, interactive and I had option, option station, all that, no option, option express, you, you're basically signing your life away in a way because the exchange, the triple A credit facility, they'll force the brokers to have a position like that. Or don't take the account in. It's not, it's not a version of rug bazaar. You're not going to be negotiating what terms you're going to have. It's the exchange. This is the largest exchange in the world, CME. They talk, and you you, you and I will listen. Having said that, so very briefly, uh, just just a little, very, very little small background, and then we get to question. If it's posted on the products, first two. The first one is when you come to a chat room, you will have this chat room. And there's a go-to meeting, not go-to webinar. We have a live chat going, uh, a couple of good moderators, a uh, very robust uh, discussion. The other one is the elite. It's the same thing, except you run it yourself. And you have access to a chat room. So it's priced differently. This is about 550 a month. This is about 770 a month. Okay, But price is not the issue. Performance is. This is a 12-month trading, one-minute performance and we, we'll keep updating and moving forward. This one, 4.4 came in. This month, I'll update that. It's a rolling number, so it moves. It's not constant. But you, you can see the results it's had. Uh, it's, uh, uh, the three contracts back then were uh, about 14,000, you know, because at 50%, you remember. It's three contracts uh, at uh, at 50% right now. We're gonna, so it's, it's actually eight grand times three. Um, actually, non grand. Nine grand times three, so it's about twenty-eight thousand. When the majority of this time for this one year back, the margins were at uh, uh, before Putin decided to be stupid and go into Ukraine, uh, it was at uh, a little bit over four thousand. So times three, you actually put like forty-six hundred. Times three came to about fourteen thousand. Fourteen thousand margin for a year. That's a ten x system. And that's no pyramiding. That was a question. That was one of the questions. Is there pyramiding involved? No. And we don't charge you extra your pyramid. That's up to you. Okay. Now, on the elite, you're limited to three contracts. If you want to go to six contracts, there's a different, you know, there's an upgrade. You know, it's like 300 bucks more. But I wouldn't go there. Not yet. You got you to run at three for a while. But as you go to six or higher, yes, that's become pyramiding. And, uh, but you want to do it from, uh, that's a different discussion for a different day. It has to do with uh, uh, your net winnings, your net net winnings. You want to use 
house money to do the paramedic. Okay, you just don't want to throw more money at it. So please, those of you on the lead, don't send me a note saying I want to get the six contracts. That's a six uh, uh, NQ versus or versus sixty MNQ. Don't send me that. The answer is going to be no. Uh, as a matter of fact, one of the things I do is I'm going to see your results. Why? Because I can. You know, simple. You know, I'm going to say, listen, you know, we control the spigot. I'm going to say, let me help you in a positive way. It's called tough love. Let me see your results, actual results, confidentially. Then I tell you if you're ready for it or not. I'm from, remember, I'm from Missouri. Show me, Stead. You got to show me. No, no, if you don't show me what you've done, that's, that doesn't fly. I'm trying to save you some headache, too. You know. Anyhow. Uh, you could see. Oh no, let's let's see. Next item. Uh, we want to talk about market texture. Very crucial. You could see over the time. Actually, we're not doing well right now. Uh, is that a bad time or a good time? Well, usually, good times come after bad times. There's always darkest before sunrise. So, go sideways, then comes back. Sideways, then comes back. So you may be coming at exactly the right time. Now, what's happening here? It's called market texture. We didn't have a wall this high not in the last two years. Okay. Last time balls were this high was in the, actually March 2020, which we were at uh, 80 VIX. Uh, we came to about 40 VIX, 41 VIX earlier. I like to look at VXN. That was a little bit higher. Most people don't look at it so that they get lost. I have to explain the problems I'm time bankrupt. But I, my favorite is VXN. I put Sigma channels on it so I can measure it against itself. So I would add, add projected we're going to have little losses here. Why is that? You can't keep changing the system constantly. That's a curve pick. Because you fix it here, then you didn't make those. Or didn't make these. Why? Because the parameters. For it to survive here, for example, one approach would be to have a very, very high uh, stop. You know, but let's say if you're short, uh, your buy stop has to be bigger. But if you're long, your sell stop has to be bigger. Well, then you won't make these gains. Remember, this is the MAE and the MFE. Most adverse, most favorable. If you've done any system design or you've read about it, or maybe even bought a couple of books on Amazon, we have a suggested leading, has nothing to do with us, uh, for different issues. It's right under about, you can go and take a look. And some of the best books I've cherished, I've used it here, I have it. Uh, uh, you can get into these areas. Uh, to, to better educate yourself, you'll see uh, it's not easy. It's not easy to go back and just say, hey, I'm going to change this, so I'm going to do better. Because you know, you're going to give back somewhere else. Um, or, for example, what time of the day should we stop What time, for the, all of the trades, like here? What time of the day uh, we should be in decision period, so on and so on. Okay? Now, let's see. We use the same colors everywhere. Okay, I'm just going to do some questions to get this thing started. You guys are welcome to post your questions there. Okay, I will not mention, if you send me an email, I will not mention your name. I'll just go over it to see what it is. Okay. Um, okay. Yes. Books? No. So I can really show you. Okay. Here's the th first thing. Uh, there's a question here, for example, I need more information so I can trade better. That's BS. Don't say that. The system is trading for you. Start monetizing it first. The rest of you have a lot at you, coming at you. Don't do that. Take the step at a time. Make the money with it. Now, this gentleman came in at the worst time possible. We had an equity peak. Okay? That means what? They're novice. They came at the top. They bought at the top. Sold at the bottom. Don't do that. They, they wait, they wait, they wait, the monitor, monitor, monitor. The system is good. This guy is good. I get it. Like it happened with PMT. In 2020, I nailed it, right? I mean, across everybody. In about, by April, there was one, there wasn't one issue on the timing anywhere. Market Watch, Time and Digest, uh, CNBC, that didn't say Barry Hemsey is gold. Problem is Barry Hemsey has cycles too. Yeah. And they came in at the very top. Then market turns around. I'm off a little bit. Remember, we, we have to trade in the future. We put the order in, saying we're going to buy here at the end of the day. That's what they gave us. And here's what we're going to do. This is our goal. Here's our time. I was wrong. 
But that there was when it was a hot streak, they all came in. Then I had two or three, one of them, a good friend of mine saying, like, what's happening here? I said, why did you wait it this long? You know, we went through a V bottom on the timer chart, for example. I'm just illustrating that. We uh where's the SMP over here? We went through uh uh there we go. The, the, this V bottom, right? It came up, they joined they joined right here. And we got into a little sausage, a little back and forth. These are weeklies, by the way. And within those, you have longs and shorts, obviously. But and they, 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 and then we, we do calls and put spreads. You get caught because of the, this is not a linear movie ad or a uh, um, client sales group, you know, of the black shoulder model. So they got disappointed. Fairy, this was also incredible. Why can't we repeat it here? I don't control the markets. I wish. Okay. Markets move and they change. It's called texture. This was, on, we had never seen anything like this. 38% drop in five weeks. Never, never. And then equally turns around and go back up. Now, we happen to catch it. That's a separate issue. We can go back to Brevin and see how we did that. But after that, things slow down. So you cannot repeat the texture back and forth and say every day is the same. Now, so basically what I would say is, again, go back, read the webinars. When watching the webinars we have, pay attention during the day, watch the user guide. Okay. Monetize this first. Don't look at other stuff. I have a good friend of mine himself. He wants this. He wants that. I said, you're going to overload yourself. And you're going to learn go to zero. Why? Retention. In, 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 in industrial engineering, when you say you high tech stuff, let's say, building a 747, okay, F5 EMF, F18s, V2 bomber, there's a retention, the learning curve that's involved. And on some projects, it's highly classified. Give me the numbers, yeah. That shows because it has to do with the skill in this mix. And the other side can know are we running out of these people or not? You see what I'm saying? So we cannot get into detail. But the learning curve is cannot be speeded up. There's so much absorption we have. You cannot run it away. And I, my goal is this. Give yourself 90 days to six months to get everything. To get everything. Okay? But in the meantime, this pays for that. The system pays for that. system has a net positive return. It's not going to be constant. It's not a, sorry, it's not a uh, straight linear curve. If we go back here. Here. It's not linear. You got some stretches, some streaks, just like your trading. Okay. Why? This is actually better than yours. Why? It's very strict. It's following exact rules. Okay. You won't have a headache. He won't, he didn't forget his coffee, or he didn't fight with the wife the night before, or the hubby the night before. That's why I'm not biased there. Some of the best some of my best traders are women, actually. Uh, so it, 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 it this follows a strict rule. What's changing here? Is the 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 the, the uh, market by what I call market violence, okay? Because it's randomized, it's what I call actually random violence, offered by the market to us, and but we agreed to come in, we signed the papers, nobody forced us to come in. It's for the big gains that willing to put up a little headache, but this will protect you on the downside. You've seen it how it protects it. Maybe it's overprotecting sometimes. Sometimes I override it. Is it smart? Probably not. But I think I know what I'm doing, and maybe I do. I don't know. Only time will tell. Um, my point to you is there's a good good size blend of things you could do. Uh, and uh, uh, hold on. One second, one second. And so uh, while you're learning more, and I know there's inclusive, all of, all of us have some inclusive mind. That's why we're here. Um, but one second. Hey, Gary. Let me see one, one more thing. Guys, hold on. One second. Oh, there we go. I'm good now. Uh, there we go. Thanks, Mike. Okay. So give yourself some time. That's a poor excuse whether this is explained or not. First of all, we have a lot here. If, if they're asking about the OTF charts, other time frame, there's a lot of them. Oh, that's a sign up. I'm sure it's not signed up. Hold on. It's not logged in. Let's go to log, log in. There's a lot there. Please, please don't tell me it's not explained there. It can't be. It's like three years of webinars. Yeah. By different issues, and you can see the most recent ones are the uh, updated ones. As a matter of fact, I should put uh, this is here too. This webinar today will go up here because this is the OIB and IB day trading system. Post IB is not finished yet. As a matter of fact, that's going to be called HR. Which we, we just we haven't even started. It. We have some ideas. The gamma ladder helped us to understand what our goals goals should be. Okay, so we're not there. But you talk about OTFs. I'm going to understand this or that. Go watch this. We even put in the early parts. Then uh, add, uh, 
uh, uh, Anne Marie and I, we did the basics there and we collaborated a couple of times in the 2017, 2018. Then Admiral came in, he did some stuff on the newer version, the upgrade called Oxygen Factor. You guys go through some of these. I know you have gone through or not because I, I quiz you. I can tell from your writing you have done it or not. There was a fellow I looked at yesterday. Um, the questions showed that he's overburdened. He just got too much going on. Yeah. So please be fair to yourself. Don't beat yourself up. Problem called retention. Yeah, you try to do too much. This is 25 years of my life. There's no way you're gonna learn this tomorrow. If you think I come in, I'm gonna give you a shot. Uh, I be whatever. He won't. Or if you come in, and I'm supposed to. I would clean you up first. Like what your Trump said, you're, you're some Lysol. We'll get, I give you a Lysol first, and then my vitamins, you're going to be fixed? No. None of them are going to work. Only time will work. Why? Texture is not constant. Market texture is changing. If it's not somebody like me or a, 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 a Ziriad or a, uh, who, who's our Roman, Roman admiral we have here? Oh, Esposito. He can quarter mar the market. He's got the know he's got the firepower. Uh, he, he's got the right tools. He could do that. No, it won't happen. They're changing the market texture. When you see something stupid happen in the market, they did intentionally. Yeah. I mean, listen, this morning, we did not, this was not great news. It was not as bad as they thought to be. We were looking for, what, 1% print on the monthlies of a CPI. It came back, it stayed at 0 0.8, 0 0.9. Yeah, look what it did. And guess what? This was a blessing for those who were short long. And then on top, they're out of the long, and now they, they run short it to wipe out some of these newbie longs that came in. This story is not finished. Why? The last slide was on no volume. So, so let me go through the questions again. Okay. Okay. Question is that I don't understand the Zoom chart on Excel and Excel Plus. Okay, let me. Go there quickly. We're going to answer that. Uh, you, we haven't watched because you haven't watched the videos. We have explained the ad nauseum what goes in there. Please, uh, we have people who've been here for several years just for OTF. OTF means other time frame, which basically means the big guys. Because if you do volume profile, okay, here's your volume profile. This is your volume profile as we go up and down the ladder. Okay, you can see this is continuous and small minuscule thing. Then a big move comes in, right about right here, for example. And this is exposed. So if you look at 1450, there should be some activity down there. Hold on. Let's see a little bit bigger. 66, I was trying to reset it quickly. Okay. You see there was a series of moves there, and up to 57, then exploded up. Okay, this is all day. So uh, if you go through the... The, 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 uh, what the volume profile does, it shows you what the moves are from what's called acceptance. When it goes through the acceptance levels that was pre-established, like a hot butter through not, uh, uh, I'm sorry, hot knife through butter, uh, then the, the big guns have come in, the, the whales. We, again, this is in the webinars. You got to go, go in detail. I'm going to do a gloss over here. So that's not our purpose here. You go and you go and download, and you get to download, take a look at it. We turned out after we uh, 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 tamed ES, we got a multi dimensional uh, volume profile in a, in a, in a, in a uh, 3D, 3D sphere, okay? At the surface level. The surface level is 3D. Now, uh, we, I'm not getting into a lot of details of it because that's very, very proprietary. We, we take a regular chart. Slightly modified using some of the DLL we have done to show what's happening inside of these. Okay. What we're moving here is the not the price, is the volume data. And it turns out there are about right now four categories. By the way, mom and pops are here before this. We dumped those out. It's a parsing. We parsed the order flow. And we, you, that's why some of the small ones move a little bit faster. That's but you see from block size what they are. Now we have to adopt our true and tested indicators. Bijan bands are red and green. This is a, uh, 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 what is it called? Uh, 
Hold on. I forgot. K bands. Uh, what's the K band? I forgot. Sorry, guys. It's been a while. Uh, Kettler. Kettler channel. Those are good. That's why they're channels. If you look at it carefully, these two the light green and light, light, whatever, light orange, whatever. They're very pale of each other. What they share is the central line. We do both to give us the change in volatility. When the Bijan bands are outside Kettler bands, volatility is coming back. When they are inside, like right now, okay, right now, look at it this way. They're coming back in. You see that? Bijan bands coming. That means we're losing for volatility. Why? We've gone nowhere fast recently. Okay? That's how that's measured. Then we have to also adapt our CI and CI diff to, to understand the inside of the bar because it's volume driven at price. That's why there's no time down here. Everybody keeps on asking me, I don't know what time that is. It doesn't matter. Who cares? You cannot trade back here. You're going to trade here. Last bar is always white. Because we don't have time, we can't tell you what time is. One member said, why don't we work on a bar that's being formed as white? Depending on how it ends, we color it. Very, very clever, these Americans. Yes, yes, very good. That's what China owns half of us. Yeah. So we did that with the help of a fellow, I forget his last name, John Anderson, I think it is. I forget. Very smart cookie over at the trade station. He only works on the email, emails for the coding. You send a problem there, he should give you an answer. So, uh, uh, Flamer, I, you, what do you mean you cannot? You log in. If you log in, you have access, right? If you log in, they're there. But you, you don't get a different page. You don't get a different email. That page, is, this is an handle. H-A-P-D-T-S dot A-S-P. Hold on. It's very simple. Hold on. There you go. I put the link to it, except you gotta be logged in. It's there. Yeah. It's been there. Remember, we renamed OTF to this package. This page has been there since I don't know. Look, look at the data here. Look at how it goes back. See that? 2019, we started doing the charts for it. Okay. And those are the lead contract at the time. It goes back. It's been there. Yeah. They haven't moved it. So yeah. All right. So let me go further. So the time frame is not an issue. The time frame actually is misnomer. Time frame is very primitive. Time frame is the past. You need to move forward in technology. Okay? Are you with me? Now, um, I don't know about DV. Forget DV. DV is, I haven't, I haven't looked at DV. That's a direction of volatility. It was written. It was uh, welcome. Bunch of people used it, but that was in 2003 and four, or maybe sooner. So I, I, I'm not visiting that. That's not subject to our work here. Therefore, I'm going to ignore that question. What is, why is Viva? I'm not here. The things. Uh, wait me for a moment. Signs of fear and greed index. Yeah, the fear and greed index are right here. These, not the index, but fear and greed has nothing to do with index. Okay, you that's you reading from other places like a financial juice. I don't. Those guys are those guys are not traders. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I help them with a ticket strike. The, the the fear, or maybe you're looking at what the CBO likes to call it as a mix fear and, or or financial new, literature likes to call it fear and greed index. But that's not what we use here. We're using pluses, and the colors change, and size change as you get close to it and become active. Fear and greed. I'm going to say what it is. Very simple. It's a multiple, it's a 1x, 1.x, I'm sorry. So 1.x of ATR, which is here, the correct ATR, by the way. No, not what comes with the machine. That has recursive formula in there. So, hold on, let me move this up. Sorry. This is the, uh, hold on, sorry. I can't see it. You can see it, I don't here. This is our solution with a problem with the ATR. It's the same problem with VVAP. It's the same problem with... Uh, uh, MBS. Trade station tries to uh, actually MBS is mine. That's not trade station. But we have to keep the same things in, in mind. What they do is that unfortunately the, the fellows who wrote this program they're not traders. They're programmers. You know, we have traders, we have programmers, and then you have somebody like me who does both. Okay. The very few people do what I do. 
And then I've got the guts to trade live, live in front of this. I have to, because that's the best way of teaching. Where I cannot take a chart that's fixed and tell you I would have done this, I would have done that. So, but how, how, why why that's important? You better learning, better tools, and better presenter makes me better. If I become better, then you got to become better. Then here's the message here. We have two lines here called the, the uh, DMZ. Now DMZ explain. You got to go read that that webinar. Remember, it's 20 years of my life. So you got to go going back and forth. Whether you like it or not, that's what is available. And there's so much one-on-one -on -one I can spend with you guys. I'm busy with a lot of stuff. So we might making this better, stuff I do in New York, so on and so forth. So go there. This is DMZ plus ATR. The amount is a 1x. I don't know what the amount is. It could be 1 half, 1.25, whatever. But it's variable based on what the correct ATR is doing. Okay. The problem, for example, on MBS is the time of day. They don't look at like Viva. Viva resets at midnight. That's okay for stocks, but not futures. Why? Because that's a legal issue. The legal day. Legal day starts at 6 p.m. For any, all times being New York City. For crude, it's 2.30 p.m. Okay, so you're both symbol dependent and obviously what time zone you're in. We, we built that. We built it in our code. So we, this is a true MBS running. That's a median of the uh, price action. For, for so since the last legal day, since last which would be uh, six p.m. So if you go here, you'll see. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Midnight. There we go. Nine, eight, seven. Here we go. See what happened? MBS from day before. See the dash line? We locked up at five. We opened at six. There's one hour off. It shoots down here and starts from that point. Then it starts computing the median constantly. So. Yeah, we, we, take, we take these things very seriously in our code. Why? Because we're trading these codes. Yeah. I'm not some program sitting in a cubby hole somewhere in the plantation. I'm, I'm, I'm trading these. So that, that, that so that's that's how these are put together. These two are derivatives are DCI. Not CI, DCI, dual CI. And the ATR is the correct ATR. So we offset it. By offsetting it, we're even pushing it further. The concept of DMZ was... You sell below the red, and you buy above, based on the close, above the green. Over a long period of time, it'll keep you very, very happy. Just is telling you what to do. Boom. Now, for us to appreciate and forecast and anticipate, remember, I'm a squash player, not tennis, squash. You need a small room with a fast ball that you can't see. It's called, now what? Anticipation. If you don't work on anticipation, you're going to really disappoint yourself. Okay? And you're going to be wrong sometimes. But after a time, you catch it. You catch it. Trust me. So, so tennis is not the solution. Do squash. I'm saying that because one of the guys sitting here is a good tennis player. But I'm just reminding him. That's the wrong sport for trading. Look at Niederhoff. Victor Niederhoff. Number one at Harvard. Uh, squash team. Yeah, he was captain. Yeah. One of the greatest traders out there. Until they clean his clock on, uh, on a box in... Uh, October of 97, read his book, the, the speculation of, a, I'm sorry, the education of a speculator. He was, he traded for source. Yeah. Yeah. So that's our offset. Now, why are we trying to do that? Market comes in spurts. We're looking for clusters. That's why we change, colors change. Now, at what level? So it's the, remember, it's the place where the color change. This one didn't hit it, it stayed red. So it's always red or green until it hits these. By the way, everything I do is that, except because of clarity here. For you guys on the ORB, I run it as thin bars. That's not my preference. On my own copies, I run it with candlestick. But because there's not enough room to see everything, we left it as a simple bars. But my preference is because I've been trained that way. Okay, This came 400 years ago from Rice Futures. There's a meaning what these bars mean, right? And the and the relation with each other, the clusters and all that. But by putting an ATR after their uh, 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 DMZ, we create excessive pressure on each side. And usually that's how we run out. Here we're out of buyers. Here we're out of sellers. So to get that, we need these things projected. So basically these are CEPs, center error probable. 
is telling you as a concept, as a system, totality of it. Most likely, this is the bottom, local, short term, and this is a local, this is a local uh, high. And you could see constantly moves. So that's what it is. It's not from a formula. It's in again. It's in the webinar. You should see it there. Why is V bad them? Okay, green and red. Yeah, green always on top, red on the bottom. CI diff, MACD plus CI. No, 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 no. This is no Mac. Don't say MACD. No, no. You'll be thrown out of the chat room. Yeah, MACD is like five generations back. MACD is like a Hellcat in the Navy. It fought the battle in the, at, uh, what do you call it, at Midway. We're flying at 14s or better. Okay. No, no. This is like sixth generation CI. As a matter of fact, if you looked at um, this the stock RSI, this is like fourth generation. Okay, Tuchon Chandler talks about this. This is his indicator. I coded it. Okay. By coding that, this was like summer of 99. I found what was wrong with it. What's missing? And the, the, the solution there was uh, limit theory. So that's been a while. I had to go back and refresh my mind. So that's what this is. So this is CI, CI diff. We're using a special version of it that we don't give out because of a space issue that allows us to put them on top of each other. But that's not the correct value. We had to raise this by multiplier. So it's pronounced. I don't want you guys to get lost there. Yeah, yeah. You need to use regular ones. But CI and CI diff. There's no MACD here. It's just that we, we, for sake of a space, remember we have a lot of other stuff coming. We're showing a ticket strike, with, ticket strike, which is not ours. That's a third party least. These are our panels that you need to look at. Here's our indicator, our uh, uh, system, ORB. Here's our HR system, the next one, not post IB. We're gonna call because we don't want to trade actually at lunchtime. This ends at twelve fifteen. Okay, see, see where it stopped. That's twelve fifteen. No longer, I mean, if it was still live, it would close right here. Okay, today we got stopped out. There was a small error there, okay, and uh, in live trading. So I'm going to do this for you and you're going to see. I'm going to bring it back. Then I got a reset on the bottom. The reason I'm doing that to see, you see what's green when negative? Okay, let me explain to you. This is a known issue. Uh, it's still doing, huh? Okay, there's something here. Right. This has happened a few times. It says we are, uh, uh, it's reversed up, that I like that, but only reversed for two and then took it out. Okay, so, uh, oh, so it's reversed three, took an early profit there at two left, I see, and then closed two. Okay, now, when this happens, that means you have to reset your machine, your, your strategy. So what you do is, uh, Disable it, not disable it, sorry. We should talk about it, I'm sorry. This is important, guys, for the elite members. You go there and you toggle it. So off, off, go. It should come back. Did I, did I disable it? Hold on, let me see. What am I doing here? I should have done that. I know, one second, guys. Remember, if you're new to trade station, please take some time understanding this. Okay, it's uh, this is on, yeah, that's off, close. Oh, 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 I go out and come back. Sorry, I go here and then turn it on. So that's on and say close. That'll bring it back now. On the elite in the user guide, you'll see a couple of settings you need to put those in also. Why this is not, uh, oh, shoot, I turned the. Oh, Fanny, you're such a schmuck. I'm sorry, it's been a long, it's been a long day. Okay, go there. We turned off this one. We turned off. You see that? Oh, sorry. Yeah, no, sorry. There we go. It goes positive. And today was wild. Now, this is the function also. How much look back you're looking at? I'm not going too far back to the CPU. Yeah. Thin line is a 50 bar. I have no idea. Thin yellow. Which chart? Yeah. You're usually the same. I have no idea there. No, I have no idea what you're talking there. Okay, uh, so we got to go back and do this separately. I, I need more explanation by give me a chart. Here's the problem 
Best way to get all of me on a problem, send me a chart. Send me a chart and write your questions. I don't want to guess where you're looking at. We have a lot of pages. Last time, a gentleman who's also here said, Fanny, hey, there's an issue here. Hey, Richard, come on in. We have an issue on this link. I said, where? You know how many pages we have? So send me the page where the link is. That has a problem. You're getting four or four. I'll fix it. Two minutes later, it was fixed. So this one, I don't have answers there. I got to figure out what it is. So that's what this said. Let me go to the next, another set from another gentleman. This one, I've already given my answers in writing, but I want to share it with you guys. Do I, when the, uh, now he's a elite member. Do I, uh, uh, do I um, open, do I start the day, I do a control C and then go to a strategy and do it starts off and on, he really meant to uh, control R, not control C. Yeah. Control C doesn't work on trace station. It's control, that means, well, that's what I just said. Refresh the data. Remember, when you refresh the data, this is crucial, guys. There's a known law in version 10. Remember, version 11 is coming. We don't know when. And version 9.5 is going to be stopped to be supplied. Why? Windows. The biggest thing this thing used, that's why they're in the same numbers. Windows 10, trace station 10. Window 11, version 11. Is the .NET? It's the it's the framework. That's how data is stored. The work that the native's boss did was his name, Scott Scott uh, Guthrie, the number two now guy at Microsoft. Uh, Why other Stanford made uh, came in at twenty is worth about uh, about six seven hundred million. It is done okay in Microsoft stock. Now he talks after Satya in the EPS as uh, earning for sure videos. That has been changing. Why do I pound the table saying update, update, update from PlayStation? I mean, from Microsoft. It also tells me one from PlayStation is coming after that. Now, they can change it so much. After some point, they're going to go. Now, Windows 11 uh, is here, pretty much. It's fairly stable. Uh, PlayStation 11 will be 64 bit. You notice these files are saying in program files x86. That's the 32 bit. It's not the regular program files. The operating system is 64-bit. They are being behind. Why? They developed their parents' company software in Japanese. Yeah. Monix. Now, trying to catch up. Still, I believe it's going to be single core. That's another bitch I have. I want multi-core 64-bit. But, you know, I'm just a poor dumb immigrant. They don't listen to me. So. All right. So, do I do that every day? No. You only do this. If your data has to be changed and there's an issue there, or and you come in the morning, you should be fine. But that's why I'm saying, and once a week, by the way, turn off your machine. At least I do it once a day to be safe. So I got a bigger problem. We have fish to fry. Plus, there are five machines. I won't get to all five every day, but I get to the majority of them. So I cycle. Or and then there's a crash comes, you have to. And dump your data. So here's what you do if the machine crashes, or we have bad data, or your UPS failed because you used it to the end, the last battery. Here's what you do. You reboot first to release everything. Don't try to change things. Let's say your, tra your trace system locks. That is probably you have a, your operating system is, needs to be refreshed. You know, you have a corruption the operating system. The poor trace system doesn't know what to do. Get stuck. I even update my operating system. By what? Wiping out the drive once a year. And it reinstall fresh. Why? Because I have archives. Here's our archives. We have archives. Go back at least 14 days. Remember, I'm, I'm obligated to a lot of people. I can't just be haphazard. I have to look at all worst case scenarios, single point of failures. I come from B2 bomber project, so I kind of I think I, I think I know a little bit of things to worry about there. That was a special mission. This is the the, the directory has to go away. Cal, first one. On only that, please. Nothing else. I've had emails from you guys. You know, on my hand slip, I got rid of a couple of things. What do I do? Nothing. Wipe out, come back in. If you don't know how, go to trade station, let them come in. Because I can't do trade station for you. We don't do basic trade station. Okay? I'm going to teach you how to drive Aston Martin. But you better have a driver's license. I'm not going to be a, your driver. Uh, school. I just don't have the time. You don't have the time to pay me for what I would charge you. Okay? So, please do some of the basic homework you got to do. If you don't, you're better off to stay in the chat room using the chat room. And it's cheaper anyway. But this is the only one you do. This, now, if you click here and you see these, too long. You've gone too far. 
you want all of this gone. So I would go here, do a right click and delete it. With the trade station off, that's what I'm saying. Now, if it failed, that means there was a crash. That means you gotta be reboot the machine so all the temp files are released. Are you with me? Don't try to fix it with the same status of your windows. Reboot, come back clean. Get rid of the camera, then restart the trace and see what happens. Now it's gonna give you a little extra time. So this is not advisable in the three middle of trades. If you have if you have positions and this happens to you, that's why I need a second machine. Yeah. Otherwise, you're in trouble. I mean, you're, you're going to have trouble uh, moving fast. I had a chip that got burnt. Yes. We had a knock. Next unit of computing by Intel. There's a little donut. Okay. Some of you probably heard that. Uh, and the, the Intel, Intel knock. Okay. These little boxes. Okay. We burned through the chip inside. You know what Intel said? I'm putting one in FedEx now. I want that one back immediately. I said, well, I got to take my memories out of that and my drive because all no no moving. There's not no moving. There's no fan. That's all the problem. But on top, I would touch it. I could make scramble eggs like you won't believe. Especially with Tico's duck eggs. That would be a great breakfast here. I, had, I bought a grill. <laughs> yeah, it just, it was incredible. So it went back. It was, we had punched through the chip. Think of uh, uh, Fukushima. That's what happened. Except to a silicon, not the nuclear uh, containment building. So, anyhow, so we, you just got to clean it. And the other thing I suggest you do, run the uh, uh, save. Uh, remember, these are questions from all kinds of questions. So we're addressing all kinds of Q&A here. Uh, go there and use this cleanup. It's made by uh, uh, Windows, so it's safe. It's not like this doctor and all that by third party. Because no, I mean, Bill Gates will change that. Just throw them off. So use the native uh, uh, program, clean it, reboot, and then come in. Okay, that's that. So when you get rid of data, yes, there's going to be a problem. You have to arm and disarm it. Don't, I mean, I'm saying, on and, on and off it, and then you have to arm it. Okay, here. These are your arm it. Again, this is also in previous webinars. Uh, you go in there, and that's your arm it. Yeah, this one to show it on the screen, this one to go, and this is the account is going to go in. Remember, you have a SIM and you have a, uh, a login. Each account has to have a login. You cannot have a just SIM by itself. It's not going to happen. Now, when you log in, there's a choice. You want to go live or you want to simulate it. Depending which one you choice, that box shows that account number. So I was asking somebody with a 9.5, what's your SIM account number? He said, what's the SIM? That was in the workout conversation. He didn't know what SIM is. Usually I tell these people, this is too early for you, okay? So you have a choice to catch up quick and stay or go out, come back next year. I'm serious because you're going to catch up. How these things are, I cannot teach you 747 cockpit in five minutes or five days. And it's not the teaching, it's the retention. A lot of you guys are good people. You listen, but you're not retaining it. Why? Overwhelmed. Or you're all over the place. Don't do that. You need to focus. Okay, so moving forward. By the way, you have more questions you can post. I'm just answering these. Is there a window that would show ongoing or trailing and daily profit and loss of ORB uh, and only for MQ? Yes, it's a function of what you put up there. It's not the loss per se, uh, but there's a there is a choice there, by the way, of uh, there's a calendar option. I don't know how to put it on. There is. Call trade station. Yeah, that's a trade station issue. Okay, I know, listen, I, even I don't know all that stuff on trade station. But there's a calendar up there that you could see. The default is today, but you can change it and say, I want last three days. You'll see what it did. Or maybe it's on the, yeah, it's on the, yeah, it's on the orders. So you could say, for example, fill orders. Hold on. I want fill orders. Remember, so you have three. One is Forex. One is the stocks. No, one, one is for, for, I'm sorry, these are three sims. Yeah, Forex. Uh, Futures, and I think this is uh, this is Forex. Futures and stocks, okay? So you have three. You have to connect. You're going to use your same. You have to connect your F account, obviously. Okay, now. But here you would have a calendar that you could say, what if you go to, I believe, field. So I would go there and say, field orders, okay? And then 
there's a date you put in and it gives you that. Okay. Uh, messages. Do you need to be not the orders? No, I, I don't know. That's a good question. We I've just tried this way. I've got my orders up and I've got my positions up. Okay. I want to know what it what is my position, what is it telling me to do? So but go to trade station. You have to email them. You can email them or set up on their web page, web page. They take you there. Yeah. They call you back. They walk you through. They log into your machine so you can see what you're doing wrong. So, one second, Ben. Let me go through this a little bit faster. Hold on. Uh, yeah. Uh, sometimes these orders stay great. Yes, they do because they're on scent. Look under order status. Listen, there's a lot in front of you. You haven't learned it yet. We have looked at it. Okay, you have not internalized it. It's you. Are, you don't own it yet. Why? It's got time. It's not your fault. You're not doing anything wrong. It's going to take time. I still don't know what I was trying to show you. There, I worked. That's me. I've been at this for a while. So remember why? I mean, last system I did, and there was an intraday. It was end of a day. It was in like 2000. 1999. I haven't touched it. That was to a window five. I'm sorry, trade session five. Very known as window uh, trade session 2000. A lot has changed. So, but you call, for example, I have some calls myself. I'm going to call in. And I'm not going to give you wrong answers. I'm going to call in and then share it in one of the chat rooms uh, from, from trade session. From horse's mouth. Go to the top. So, so that's what happens. But you should see the blue. The color turns to blue. Then that says received. Others are gray. Now, you can even change those colors. Again, that has to do with your settings there. There's a lot of settings you can go. There's preferences. You just quite a bit. You can't break anything. Go test it. If you don't understand it, call them. Don't call me. I just can't do it. I don't have the time. I don't have the time. My mission is different. Okay? And I'm responsible for a lot of things. So please, go to trade station. That's the basic. We don't teach you the basics. We don't have the time or manpower. We will have to charge you a lot more to have those manpower on, online to be available. So you go there. I know you trust. One of the answers emails was, but I trust you. Please don't say that. There are good people there too. They know their stuff. I learned it from them. So go there. Uh, can I overwrite the ORB order? Yes, you can. What you do is you right click, you have a settings, and you add your order bar. That's it. You can do it. You can open it up. Now, we're running automated for you guys, so we don't have it there. You can do it. There's your buttons. Yeah. If you hit buy, it's in. Boom, it's going to go in. Even the symbol is going to go in. Here's your stops. Here's your amount of the stops. This is five points. You can go percentage. Don't use percentage. Don't use percentage. The values are too high. Don't, don't, don't. Go, go by stops. I would use a ATR or, or multiple of. Either half of it, depending on what time of day. 100, you know, what? Full amount, 23 handles. Always, I was round up, say 24 handles. If you want to go 50% more, it would be 36. You plug it in there. You hit sell stuff. If it's long, boom, in. Buy stuff if you short, boom. Now, if you move it, you're going to see it up there. And it will show on your orders. On your active orders, it will show you waiting. Now, where? You put it in on the orders. Remember, it's not strategy anymore. Anyway. Okay? So it's not strategy orders. It's your orders. If you go there, oh, there you go. See that? On orders, you see that? There you go. So you can go and see what that's done. So you can go back and say, what did we do yesterday? I mean, uh, hold on, not March 20th. Let's go here. Uh, do you see that? No, no. If I go here and say, I want just yesterday. Boom, you can. Boom. And retrieve orders. Oh. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on. Murray, okay, Murray, don't shoot, don't shoot. One second. Guys, I will take to all the questions. You give me a chance, let me get there. Okay, retrieve orders. What happened? Did you wipe it out or what? Oh, you need the symbol? No, symbol was, uh, it was uh, NQ. What are we running? NQM22.D. Yeah, okay. And no, open, oh, oh, sorry. Field orders, boom, retrieve. Oh, why? 
April 22? Yeah, it should be. Huh? We traded yesterday. Huh? Hold on, hold on. Hey, Alexander, hold on. Hold on. Let me check something here. Remember, this is not scripted. Yeah, or by 963. Yeah. I have no idea why it's not doing that, but that's how it works. So, yes, you have, you have some, some, maybe I was not saving the history. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Hold on, there's a chat there. Uh, okay. Yes, I can. Now I can, Mike. Yes. Um, um, no, hold on. Let me go back. Uh, Uh, hold on one second. Yes, sir. Okay, yes, sir. Okay. Hold on. All right, let me see. Now I can. Hold on one second, guys. Why is this not going up? Okay, so let me pull this thing down a little bit. Um, okay. Yeah, I can see it now, Mike. Okay. So. Peter, I'm in the middle of a webinar. I'll call you back. Hey guys, that was from uh, Trade Station. I tried, I took it. It was pure Alvino. But remember, he's a Roman. His timing couldn't be worse. So, hold on. What's the question? So, let me go this. I'm almost done here, guys. Let me through these questions and I'll come to you guys on the new ones. Okay. Can I do override? Yes. Yes, you, I just showed you with these buttons. We just don't show it because to us in the webinar, that we show or go to meetings, whatever. It, the space is limited. I want to see, I'm going to show you guys big characters you can see it easily. Some people have a 15 inch. By the way, mo to monitor us properly, I suggest you get a 27 to 32 inch monitor. No need to be 43 per se, but 23, I'm sorry, 27 to 32 inch, because this is coming to you at 55 inch. Okay? When you look at 15 inch laptop, I just close the guy's account. It was trial. I told him. I'm not going to use your time. I'll give you reserve it for you. But you come back. You, I need to have a picture of you there. On the phone, we'll do it. I want to make sure you have a 32 in front of you. If you do that, then I get this. But then I would give you the balance of your trial. Or give you a full trial. Another three weeks from Scott. But I need you to go there. Because what? he learned nothing. He was completely lost. He couldn't see what the signs were and so forth during the day. Colors were not clear for him. So don't do that to yourself. Remember, you need to do a basic stuff to be involved with 7X system. Cream rises to the top. Show me that you deserve that. I'm sorry, but that's how it's going to be. Why? You know what the demand is for this? So I'm going to be picky. Yes. Uh, why? Because I can. Because we, I cannot hold on to the rest of the ship. Remember? Crimson uh, uh, Tide? He says, close that hatch. He killed eight of his own men to save 140 more. That was the option. They all go down the ship, or he, he, he saves a bunch uh, in the back and the front. They died. So they were stuck in a bad area anyway. The damn thing blew up inside. So you have to look at what is the best for the majority of people. So if you are holding down the train, as you're slowing, the train can only go as fast as the slowest cars in there. Okay? That's the case. I got to let it loose. So certain minimums you gotta do, okay? It, it, this is not a cheap one. You cannot get to this level by being cheap about it. Think about practical, think about value. The issue is value. It's not the cheapest solution. It's the best value solution, okay? And remember, given these returns, we charge very little. So please improve your hardware. Please have UPS. If you don't have a UPS, we don't allow you to come in and have a leak. I have a friend who does not has not put on the UPS yet, very soon, I'm going to cut him off. Yes, yes. 
It is for your own good and less headache for me. You got to follow instructions. If you have problems with authority, this is not for you. Trade system training is authority issue. Yeah. I won't mention a name. The guy who owned the Blue Hill in Malibu. He ruined a big account because every time we send him option trade, he wants to modify it. In front of his wife, who owned the money, not him, he married well. He says, we're having, we're, looking, we're having lunch there outside, looking over the Pacific Ocean. He goes, it wasn't my trade. It was your trade. I had to modify it to be my trade. I want to trade my trade. I walked out. I said, thank you for lunch. Walked out. I closed the account that day. Yeah. And it doesn't mean a lot to come back. Okay, what does happy short STVOL do? Happy STOL is, hold on, let me put this back, is short-term volatility. Now, this game became a little bit big here, guys. I will to adjust it. Hold on, let me bring it. It's short-term volatility. It's the same as ATR, except it's a correct ATR. Okay, we, we went in there, see what the code is. I know Ralph Waters' work. I have a couple of his books here. We're going to look at what he had in his book. And I noticed that there was a recursive formula. But recursive is that he was looking at itself again and again and again. Can't do that. We changed, we, we, we opened it up, copied it into my own code, put some encryption on it, and corrected it. Uh, happy indicators. Yeah. Uh, these are details. This is, uh, this is involved with the stocks. Uh, we have what's called a swing. We suggest you guys use the swing if you need be. Um, yeah, there's a question about DCI and P OIB, this and that. What else do I need? Nothing, master what you got in front of you. Please, please show me that you've mastered this part. I can tell from emails what things you haven't done. I've had 12,000 people through here, these are traders. Some of them couldn't make it, some of them did very well and went to bigger things. Some are here, and of course. Markets change, people, you know, sell, blow up. A lot of things happen during it, during the different market upheavals. So nothing is constant. But uh, my point is, you've got to walk before you run. Please take your time. This is it. Majority of this work is a paradigm shift. So do not put a schedule on yourself. It's how, how good you get it. And if you put a schedule on yourself, you're saying yourself psychologically, for a failure. It's called self self talk. And traders are very good at it. When they your truly, Barry Hamza, your truly. I do three trades in one day. Okay. Oh Jesus. I'm Moses. I walk on water. I part the Red Sea. On the way down, I give it all back. Why? I got cocky. The reverse is true. Okay. I go there and uh, uh, a great opportunity shows up. Let's say, let's say I was long here. Okay, you're with me? I get long here. I get crushed. There's a buy opportunity. I'm not willing to touch anything I'm so because I'm so crushed. I didn't do nothing about adjusting it for it. I didn't sell and try to buy here, sell again, try to buy here, sell again, and then buy and hold on. No, I sat through it. So here, I'm totally crushed. A great buying opportunity comes. I'm not ready. I'm waiting for proof. Why? I've lost my confidence. Confidence is about what you're about to do in the future, not what the chart already showed you. This is rear view mirror. You cannot trade here. You can only trade right there. So tell me long or short. Where you don't know, nobody knows. This is live training. Live training. Nobody does what I do. But I think there's a huge value. That means I cannot fool you. No market can't fool you. Nobody. It's just there in front of you, live. And you have a robust chat room that analyzes live. There's a value there. And you have very good players here. Those who have lasted. Look at Johnny. He's been with us five years. He probably understands OTF better than I do. But why? You know, first year, how many questions he had? He's an ex SAP trader from the floor. Already came with massive experience. Massive experience. An ad trader. And, you know, limit up, limit down. You know, very, very risky stuff on low volume. That's ad. I remember the first year. Oh, God. There he is again. No, no. But I mean, we used to call him Eastern European support because the Roman support couldn't handle him anymore. <laughs> yes, believe it or not, we had a Roman support desk. Yeah. So, but how do you get over it? Day in, day out. 
Johnny was there. And so just to have him work with me closer, I said, you're in charge of the IB. My indicator, I call it IB. And now we call it Johnny's levels, actually. I said, he's in charge of analyzing what this is doing. Give us odds. Give us next levels because some of you don't have this. Okay. And so on and so forth. Now he's part of my team. He pays for it. Don't get me wrong. He, he, he pays for the services. But he loves some of the stuff we have. He's been with me five, six years, at least, I think, since Chicago. Pretty much what happened in Chicago. So it's my honor. Somebody with that background who stayed here longer. You know how many other guys from the floor came in and didn't make it? They just couldn't get it. Or they had all the equipment they were not willing to invest. They didn't buy something better. Didn't get more comfortable with the machine or the seat or the pipe. UPS does all comes in. You'll be surprised in the heat of a battle what matters. Now, the only way you're going to know it is long period of time. You don't have that time. I understand that. Or the capital. I'm sharing it with you. So please trust me and do it. Go get that 32-inch monitor. Don't argue. Believe me, it will be better for you. I wouldn't. My name is on the door. Why would I give you advice that I know it's wrong? It's not. Trust me. Okay. One more here. Let's see. Uh, question about the watch list. Those are in webinars. The watch list is here. Okay, I'm done with the emails here. The question on the watch list is uh, when we run the happy expert. You need happy expert for that. Okay, but again, we're not charging enough there either. We charge like 300 a month. It's 300 months. Nothing, okay, for what it does. We'll go there. Watch this. This one. This one. This one. This one. This is crucial. This webinar and the response you guys gave me is why we have uh, ORB. This. Because we showed this. We showed what this means. And we showed what these uh, bubbles mean. Okay. How do you go to these bubbles? What the settings are? Clusters and colors, and how do you get to these? Now, not everything here is available on Expert. I, I'll never give everything out. I have to keep some edge, a little bit. So, but we explain that, and then the schmuck that I am asked myself, why can't you make this into a training system? So I went to our uh, beloved programmer and said, listen, AI guy, uh, system administ system, uh, uh, system developer, I should say, can we do this? And he goes, oh, you know, it sounds interesting. I guess that's, that means yes, I guess. And we started, and that was last year. Last uh, June or so. It took me a while to write the request, you know, the SOW. And, but he's absolutely awesome. In, incredible. I've learned so much from him. I think what I've learned since August of last year would be a equivalent of everything I knew of PlayStation for the last 25 years. So there are more questions here. So let me go here. Okay, let me ask the question. So, all right, so let me go through here. I can't go through the very beginning, but let me go through Baron. Baron, Chris Baron, let me go through that, sir. Thank you. Uh, and thank you for coming to the class. You're coming to every other program. You're coming there every day. Uh, so you are upgrade to 9.5, yes. Yeah, we'd say the version of all that in the page. Here's what we do so you know. The reason we put it in writing is because of liability. The financial industry is highly regulated. And in, in this area, CFTC, you don't want to mess around with CFTC. We do what they ask. That's what we give you big, big uh, uh, caveat emperor, which is buyer beware. These are the risks you're taking. That's why you have the huge, huge sign up. I mean, uh, wake up. even on a sign up, you go here, you'll see before you get signed up, there's a lot of lingo here that you have to watch. You gotta, you gotta, there's some risk involved. It's not easy. It's a system trade. Well, so it is high. This is a large contract now. Remember, this number, whatever we're trading last, right? Times 20. It's a $280,000 stock. Think of it that way. Almost $300,000. It's not, it's not for kids. So you have to have a stomach for it. Why do I say that? Because I know that's going to happen. Yes, there have been times... A drill and lush was so bad for me, I could not hold food in my system for three days. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And if you're lucky, <laughs> one day that will happen to you. It's got trading too much science. Yeah. Don't do that. Keep it small. So, uh, so you need you need to go through some you know, basics here, the warnings and all that, so that you come in with your eyes open. The other trading, the difference is 
This one, you get these codes. We give you the ELD codes. I'm sorry. It was a one landing page, by the way. There's one landing page to keep things simple. Landing page is here. When you logged in, you land into the product. This, this is up here. This is after this is after login. But there's one, but we have just what we do with PMT. Clever coding, where it knows which by, by you coming in, it knows what access you have. So if you have elite, these show up. Th these four. If not, you don't access. It just you have the uh, user guide and you land in the room. That's it. Through these levels. But if you uh, are user, uh, you have a your elite user, then these these are available. They're live. Why there's a copy here to get you started quickly? We still have to give you a code, update key. What's first time you come in, and then at the end of each month, we'll send you new keys. For example, right now we're in April, on the 30th or 29th, we'll send you a key that will cover us through May. Okay, let's see. So, see, 29th Friday. So on 29th, I'm sending the code out. Okay, and you can uh, you you can run it, and it will allow you to go through all of May. We did not do it like we do with the indicators for three months to lower the barrier for to for entry. Instead of asking five hundred a month, we have to ask you, or five fifty five, we have to ask you sixteen hundred. You know, five fifty five times three. No, do that. So let's do it monthly because this is a little bit bigger expenditure. And also, you may come in and find out this is not for you, so you don't want to be obligated for three months. You just do it for one month at a time. So, but. The downside is once a month, you're going to get that permission and key. And there's a workspace, which is a little bit like this, but doesn't have this part. This space is special for the chat room. This part, this, uh, th th this part is not there. So I just want you to be aware of it. Yeah. Now, some of you have a happy expert. You can build some of it. Yeah. But again, it's not a system yet. When we get the HR done, we get you get that system, same price. We're not rising our price there. Let me close that. But let me come back here. So I'm going to his questions. Uh, that's a big difference. Is, yeah, but you can still come to a chat room. A lot of people do. Look at Susan. I've known Susan be a system designer, a system trader for at least 10 years. And once we were ready, I think we were like second version of Elite, second release of the independent code for you to run. Remember, that's a separate problem. You have to keep track of a lot of things for you. And we would need your account number. Because that account number goes into, and we're not looking for your login. We need your account number. That's where it's got to go. See this? Right there, that would be your account number. It says live. We can only give you one account number. If you want to shortly run a SIM, no problem. We'll give you the SIM. You give us, you give us your SIM, we put it in there. And then at some point, we'll switch it to, uh, what do you call it? to a live. We cannot go back and forth. Okay? And the whole point is, Get the sim out of the way. And then one guy came in the other way. And then he actually returned to the reverse. Says, Can I get the sim back? I said, sure. Not sim back. I'm saying, Can I have the sim? I don't think I'm ready. I said, Good, good, good. That's a good, honest, uh, uh, you know, admission. You know, you, I want you to be winners. That means you have to walk before you run. When you're going to jump ahead, you're going into trouble. So, no, trading rooms are, oh, no, you have trading room to both. Both packages have trading room. Just one and one, and the chat and all that, but one of them has the code to create this page. This this part, this part. Hold on, so let me go there. Here, this part. If I go here, this part, you get this. Well, of course, it's pre-made, so you have these two parts up there too. So you say, what we do is a turnkey. You plug and play. Well, all you do is put first of all put the ELD in the code, then you copy the trace station, but they have to be same version. This has to be same version. Right now. I was doing a test for 0.9.5. It's mis failing miserably so far. For that one, we uh, we we put a 28. They have 28, but 18. Last time 9.5 was updated was at December 1st or end of November of 2018. So it was right after midterm election. That's four years ago. What are you doing? Hang around with that. Are you telling me it's more stable than 10? You gotta be kidding. Whatever you're smoking, send me some. I want some. It's good for my psoriasis. Yeah. Uh, okay. Now, uh, hold on. No, the code is the same. The page is different. It just doesn't have this part. The code here is the same. It's exactly, no, no. Uh, Alex, I'll get to you. Well, let me handle it. Right. This part is exactly the same. You will get these results, both the colors and the signs and everything. Yeah. You get this. You cannot get this yet. 
And what I would give there would be a system. This is not a system. This is what we call a strategy monitor. What we have, which I learned from the shaman, is a way of better improving our system development. It reminds me of going back when we were building B2, B2, B2 Bomber. And I can't get into detail how that was because I have a lifetime non disclosure. But let's say F18, you know, when we had filled, filled the first 12. I remember a couple of weeks ago, I went to see the F18Es, the Super Hornets. Some 30 years later, more than that, 40 years later. But if we didn't done those 12, we wouldn't have Super Hornets. So we're this, what's called strategy monitor indicator. So it's indicator class. Because remember, the class of products. That means it has some functions in there. It'll color, it will not trade. This one has got two parts. Let me show you. Two parts. One is the indicator, one is the trader. So don't confuse the two. You need both. That's what we give it to you in the uh, page. The page automatically kicks it in. Ready to go. It's a turnkey. You put ELDs in, you put the page in the workspace, and boom, goes. Again, these are explained in other webinars too. Here's the thing. You have an indicator. There's an indicator, which are these dots. These dots are the indicator. Shows you what to expect. You see the status. And in the room, you're going to learn. There's the wall I'm doing here. That is a, you need super, that comes with a happy expert. This one is issued by a strategy by a trade session. That's not ours. It just shows what it is for the, that period, what happened to the equity, equity curve. Yeah. Okay. No, again, no pyramiding. You can do that, but I won't show that. That's just number of contracts you trade. Now, on the contract, that's your only input. We may occasionally improve this. As a matter of fact, I'm getting really possibly to issue one this week. Possibly. It depends what kind of progress I have. But the only input you have is a uh, uh, number of contracts. Why do you need that? In case you're trading, trading MNQ. How does it know which symbol? It's up here. It runs whatever the symbol you have, which is NQ or MNQ. It's have to have a dot D. It, anything other than that you put there, it fails. Boom, no go. It has to be NQ or MNQ. You, uh, dot 22, you know, so it's a 22 dot D. Why? We want to get pure value. We're not trading the uh, 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 consecutive. If you're doing a back test, that's a different issue. Then you put at nq.d. At nq.d. That means that you don't care. You just want to leave contract. Okay, so it rolls back. That's for back testing. Okay, now uh, you can do three nqs, but if you were running mnq up there, you can go here and say, uh, Customize, you bring this up and you make that three, six, gotta be multiples of three, three, six, nine, 12, all the way to 30. So 30 MNQ because the one tenth is a clone to three NQ. We do have a six version too. You can go to six NQs or 60 MNQ. That's a, uh, like a thousand bucks, it's 300 bucks more. Yeah. And uh, we have only so far one person asked for it. That's fine. And that's, you don't need to go there. I suggest start with three. Make, listen, start with simulator. Make money on the paper. If you cannot make your simulator, where are you going? Stop. You're going to be in trouble. So you need to you know, make sure you work on that. Then you, from simulator, you go to MNQ. Start start making money on MNQ. And then you go to NQ. Then to six NQ. So. Yes, I'm doing some. Yes. Because, Alex, I run multiple accounts now. I run a fund, yeah. And sometimes that's a good idea, sometimes it's a disaster. Who knows? This morning, a part of it was a disaster, part of it was good. Yeah, yeah. but no, but you follow this. You guys follow this. I can, you can mute me. Yeah, you have a choice. You can mute me, yeah. Or I, I'll mute mine. I get into issues, I gotta mute mine. Yeah, yeah. So question is, are you, are you doing, or I'd be my own trades? No, I'm running following this. Remember, the system is a super indicator. It really looks after you. For sure, downside. So when this gets stopped out, I gotta rethink what I'm doing. No matter what, only gives us say some from somewhere else. But we do use o, uh, OTF. So we use ORB and OTF. OTF, especially after 10, 12 15. Remember, the system only trades in the morning, two and a half hours. He made 88% one day, no, December 3rd. It's on Twitter, it's on uh, Facebook. 88% in two and a half hours. Yeah, nine grand. On twelve thousand now. Back then, it was the no fourteen thousand. It was four point four thousand six hundred per contract, 
and Q3 of them, or oh, was 12, uh, it was like 14. Yeah, it got to go close to 14, so say 14,000. And made nine grand that day. That's 88%. Whatever it is, I, I, I showed the math. So. so that's what happened there. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine, Alex. Yeah, I'm fine. I understand that. Uh, no, no, just ORB. The performance just ORB. Because that's the structured. That's a very good question. Is it training performance or It's just ORB, yes. Remember, it's the worst case. It's always the worst case. That's a baseline, if you will. Okay? So I've answered those. Any other questions for me? Oh, oh, oh no, hold on, hold on. Bian, did I answer all your questions there or not? Yeah, the difference is not the access to the room. Both have to access to the room. No. The other one has access to the code encrypted to run on your machine. Yeah. Yeah. Right. The, okay. The code for the page. Yeah, yeah. It's a, exactly. Yeah, correct. Correct. Uh, anything else here, guys, I need to answer? I gave the shows there. Okay. Now, we constantly improve. We see something that we need to address. We do. Uh, yeah, don't use 9.5. Also, make sure you have Windows 10. Also, you're using Windows 10 Pro. You know the difference between Pro and Home? Home is for kids. Yeah. Pro is actually a big portion of Pro is a communication gear. What do we do here? We communicate. You saw, if you come Saturday, you see how many orders move. You need these to be transmitted properly. And the difference is like 90 bucks. Go on uh, Microsoft Store right here. It's on every platform. Okay, go to Microsoft Store, and you can buy it right there. You just use your login account that you have for Windows, and it probably has a some sort of pay system there, like there's a Google Pay, what have you. And let's see what that is now. Let's say this is a window. Let's say window 11, 10, one, Pro upgrade. You just want to upgrade. It should be like ninety nine bucks or eighty nine bucks, whatever it is. Hold on, come on. Let's see what that is. Yeah. Uh, what? Huh? Hold on. Murray, what are, you, what are you doing to me, Murray? Hold on. No, no, no. Apps. No. Uh, let's go there. Let's see what it is. Huh? No. Hold on. Window 10. Uh, I'm not trying to buy hardware. Give me my apps. Okay. Okay, there we go. So if you follow this routine, it tells you what you need. But I would, and you don't need the workstation, by, by the way. That's a workstation. That's heavy. You don't need that. You don't need that. That's for somebody who designs, uh, uh, let's say, uh, airplanes, you know, cat and cat, cat. All you do, or you're doing very, very heavy doing, doing Excel. You don't need that. Just get the upgrade to Pro. So hold on. That's home, actually, yeah. Yes, yeah, you don't want to have home. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what's happening. It's there. It's always here. But if they don't offer that, I don't know. So if you have a window, I guess maybe because it's coming in as window 11, so let's see. Go to 11. Uh, not 12. Hold on. Home. Like this is how they're shipped, if that, some of them, if they're not ready, go to 11 and get that. And it's a download. It takes about half an hour to install. It's got to be here. Huh? Come on. I don't know where it is. What's well, in under Windows setups? I mean, Windows updates. But you can go there and get it done. That's what you need. You install it, reboot, and go. Boom. All right. So let's see. Now, uh, the other thing is uh, run your uh, update. Make sure you update it constantly. It's crucial. Why? If you're using a trade station. If you're not using trade station, it doesn't matter. You're coming as a browser. Use Chrome or Edge to come in. Good speakers. Make sure they're working. And it's for a first date. Yeah, just make sure you can hear me and all that. Or Peter. Uh, and use uh, um, uh, uh, high-speed internet. Uh, now, on the, on the Elite, you need to update. Make sure you come here, you've updated. Okay, update these first. Clean your di disk, your disk setup. And you need a UPS. 
we're not going to, after what happened recently, we're not going to approve anybody to go into a lead without a UPS. Because you're buying a headache. Two, two areas of UPS help, helps you. Your your chips, to stay fresher, and your, your color, the color of your monitor. Okay? So Remember, for trading, you don't need a fancy machine on trading side, per se. You just need a fast machine. Yeah. Yeah, you don't need a, a gamer or anything. No, no. But you need a solid machine. And you put UPS on it, you're there. Uh, and and, and just, now, if you want to browse it, but for seeing the webinars, I mean, this, I mean, these go-to meetings, I suggest you go at least 27, maybe 32. Below that, you get into trouble, I'm telling you. So, you're going to be confused during the day. One trade pays for the machine. You see what I'm saying? Okay, any other questions for me? Are we good? Not good? Is there anything left unanswered? I'm going to record it. I'm going to post it. You know, uh, no biggie. Hey, Heath, how are you? Uh, long time no see. You got here a little bit late. That's okay. Hey, Jeff. Okay. Oh, come on, it's back. Good, good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, it just, it just, it's little stuff. You know. For example, if your UPS, I'm sorry, is not where your router is, get a small one for the router. The different room, like mine is in there. My router is here. But I have a junction box in a laundry room where it comes to the house and goes to the cable and the internet all over the units, you know, and it runs like eight, eight different TVs slash monitors, right? The problem is uh, I, I need to uh, I need to make sure that one has a UPS. I don't have time to go and check to see if there's a problem or not. So I have a little $40 UPS. It doesn't have to be a big one. The ones I have here are sine wave. For your machines, get a sine wave. That should be around 200, 250. First trade you miss is going to be very painful. That was caused by UPS. You could have avoided it. Yeah. It's a small insurance. I mean, I have backups, even on the internet. I have three backups. Main system is hardwire. Make sure hardwire. Don't do wireless. Wireless is for kids. I mean, the, our fellow that was having, spending the wife's money, the fortune, on uh, Malibu, he was on a laptop on, on basically on his private beach up on top of the mountain. I mean, or hills. Don't do that. Make sure it's wired. Um, so I have wired from Comcast at 1.2, 1.4 gig. I have a backup that has automatic backup, switches over. That's a new version for Comcast for business they offer. That's a 25 meg with uh, Verizon. And then I have two Verizon MiFi's. There's no way all, all three going to fail. There's no way. Right? I came from B2. I understand fault isolation and uh, redundancy. You know, we had some systems of it. I would say it was more than three. I can't get into detail, but more than three levels. That means for it to fail, at least three have to fail. If you give it 95% <coughs> survival rate, you could see how small <coughs> the chance of total failure would be. But that's how you make it mission critical uh, operation uh, done. Because once the president decides we got to do this, <coughs> there's no going back. We have to do it. <coughs> Any other questions for me? I'm going to close this. Go back to our go to meeting. Some people will go out to the those who registered for this webinar, and we'll see you again. Now remember, these webinars come back. If you want to update, I'm going to take this one for example down today. Here's what it is. Uh, it's, it's, you don't need a login to come in. Or if you're logged in, it still shows the same page. This just reminds you what's the latest going on. This will be taken down today. So we'll be back to two. If you registered today, you're, always, you're going to be involved in this. Don't worry about it. It reminds you. You can you have a choice to come in or not to come in. This is one way for us to keep two sets of interested parties. Market timing is that. Once you register, it's there. If you want to be taken out of it, send us an email. We can go into go to meeting and drop you. It's one out of, out of our systems, and it's very crucial. Nobody else gets to list. Okay, guys? Are we good? Okay. We, we're going back to open the go to meeting uh, for our members. For the last two hours, I need to make some shekels. So. Have a great one. Bye bye now. How do I open this? I'm sharing stuff.